see everybody in here. Not on my porch. I already drank my coffee. I got up way, way early this morning. And I was up all night thinking about things. So uh, I started a project. Yep, I got my tools out, got my little bench, and those three panels are actually connected together. And all I've got to do is add some wood. And uh, not sure if that is exactly going to work. I'm not sure if the wood that I have is going to be strong enough, but it's going to have to be something that reaches all the way across this way, you know, this way and this way. So, whew, I'm just tired. I'm going to take a break. I may wait until the sun starts going down to finish this because I need to get some amperage in, some wattage, some volts, whatever. Somebody correct me on that. When it, you're bringing the power in, is it referred to as watts or amps? Anyhow, I'm working on this and I am bound to determine to rig up something. It may not be permanent, but at least it'll be something that will make it easier for me to move all three of these panels around at once. While we're waiting around for the sun to go down, here's a cute little snippet of footage I took of Betty. Um, I was watching her eyes because sometimes her eyes kind of dart around and I, I was paranoid that, oh, is she going to have a seizure, you know, is that nystagmus? But what I really think it is, she just kept looking up at me and she was so tired and she just want to go to sleep and her little eyes are just kind of like looking up and she just doesn't want to close her eyes, I guess, and she's staring right at me. What a sweetie pie. She just wants to go sleepy by so bad. She's had no seizures, no weird, you know, movements. She hasn't had that problem of not being able to support her hindquarters. Uh, I've just been feeding her pretty much people food. Um, a little bit of dog food, but mostly people food. And I keep a snack by the bedside and feed her first thing in the morning and then last thing before bed. And she seems to be doing just fine. And oh, look, 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 look. She's almost there. She's almost going sleepy by. I just love this dog. She's been so good lately. Although she keeps barking at the neighbors and the dogs and whatnot, but that's all right. That's to be expected. So, I don't know. I think right now I'm going to go lay down and take a little nappy poo. We're just going to take a nap. Miss Betty and I. I'm going to put on a movie and just kind of chill out and fall asleep because I have not slept in a couple of days. Talk to y'all later. While Betty and I are napping here, take a look at my berries. I've got them growing all over my property like I showed you before and many of them are getting ripe and yep, I did. I did taste quite a few of them, the ones that were ripe and some of them are super sweet, some of them not as sweet. I don't know if the next time I go back to look for them, if they'll still be there, or at least not enough to make wine, but you know what? I've got fields of them all over the place. You may not be able to see the berries, but you'll be able to see the leaves. So maybe tomorrow I will go looking for berries Maybe I'll have enough to make some wine. Enjoy! story short I didn't get the rest of the solar panel thing built um, I'll show you all of what I did yesterday I've just got to do a few more things to it and I think it's, it's just going to be a very simple rudimentary frame connecting all three panels together to so they'll be easier for me to move um, so I'm going to finish that up tomorrow what happened is I went out galley van and looking for berries I found this many berries I got them soaking in water right now um, just to get the bugs out and then I'm going to drain them and put them in the freezer, get them all nice and frozen. Or I could just put them in the fridge, that'll be okay too. But, you know what, I think I ate too many of the berries the last time. Um, 
<laughs> I ate so many berries when I went picking them. But there's a lot more out there. They're just not ripe yet. And I didn't spend very long looking either. So, I don't know. Maybe about five or six more times, ten more times, maybe I'll have enough for wine. Anyhow, while I was out, I heard Mr. Uh, Lucas pull up in his lawnmower. And he wasn't pulling up to mow my lawn. He was pulling up because I hadn't really been out and about and around for the last two days. And he says, are you all right? Is everything okay? <laughs> he came to check on me. And I explained, yes, I've had some weird intestinal something going on and um, I'm fine now. You know, I'm just really tired and I think a part of it is, well, not sleeping enough and um, not eating consistently enough. You know, I'll get involved in something, a little project or I will um, start reading. I've been doing a lot of research on various different things um, and tonight is going to be poke salad. He's got a big poke plant growing over there he wants to give me and so I need to learn how to cook it. So, and I'll just get sidetracked for hours. I'll just be doing something or reading something, um, and then I'll forget to eat. You know, you'd think I'd be thin, but no. So, we'll just go ahead and do all that tomorrow. We'll just cut this video here, and uh, see you the next time. That's all I got for you. See you in the next video. Look at my berries. Luscious berries. Yay! Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.